Okay, so find the volume. One way you could find the volume is you say it's the area on the front multiplied by the depth. Uh, or likewise, you could say it's the area on the front, which is this side here. If you look at it from the, the, this side, uh, that's 8 root 6 times how deep it goes. And likewise, you could do the same thing on the top. 4 root 3 times z. If you multiply these together, you get b cubed equals uh, 64 uh, root 2 times 6 times 3. Well, that's 2, 6, 36 actually, x, y, z. But x, y, z is the volume. So you get v cubed equals 64 times 6 times v. So the volume can't be 0, so I'll divide by a v, and that becomes uh, v squared. So v is the square root of this, which would be 8 root 6. Yeah, okay. Find the two roots here. Oh, does this have... Does this have factors? How long will I try to factorize it for? 3x, x, um, 35, 5 and 7. Kind of has to be 5 and 7, doesn't it? Um, 5, 7, 21 and 5. Maybe the other way, actually. 7 and 5. 15 minus 7 is, yeah, okay. X is 7 over 3, or X is minus 5. This I can write as 3 power 1 times 3m squared plus 8 times 3m minus 35 equals 0, which is the previous quadratic. So 3 power m equals 7 over 3 or um, minus 5. But 3 power m cannot equal minus 5, so you reject that. And you get 3 power m plus 1 equals 7. So if I put a log 3 on both sides, uh, you would get m plus 1 equals log 3, 7. So then that means m is equal to log 3, 7 minus 1.